Hi guys, welcome to the channel. Uh, today we're at Cheadle Golf Club, which I believe is the second oldest club in the northwest. So we're uh, nearly nine holes. Uh, I believe there's some practicing facilities. We have a look at them. So I'm going to take you around with me. So if you have a party in Cheadle, and you fancy nine holes, um, right underneath a fire path. See what I can show you. So yeah, if you like planes, <laughs> ideal place to come and watch planes as well. So right, so we're going to go off to the practice ground and we'll take you with us. Back shortly. Alright guys, we're on the first tee, not particularly sure I like the first tee because uh, if you slice this to the right, you're in the car park and in the clubhouse. Um, so I think we'll have to play safe <laughs> and not go with the driver just for this first hole because uh, I don't fancy uh, smashing a few windows. Right, first hole we go and I'll pick you up uh, when we make to the second. Hi guys, as you can see, it's starting to rain and there's a plane going over. So, first hole, not know where I'm playing, quite interesting. Played safe just to make sure that uh, I didn't slice it into the clubhouse, which was quite good. <laughs> so, we're on the second hole, and it uh, looks like it's just straight down there, so we'll give it a go. We'll see what we're like. Uh, at the moment, the course seems okay. Greens are okay. Um, not been in a bunker yet, so that's good news. And it's quite busy for a uh, normally. Normally, when I drive past there during the day, it's, it's empty. There's nobody on it. So I think they're, uh, they have pushed the membership up, which is good. Um, so yeah, so we'll go for the second hole and we'll see how we go. And hopefully, we won't get too wet. We we'll have to put our waterproofs on. Back shortly. Hi right, guys, we've just done the. Uh, third hole and the, uh, the first first and the third you've got houses on your right big sign about insurance so yeah it sort of puts you off the game slightly if you're going to uh, you're worried about slicing it or and it also says which I find quite bizarre no five woods or three woods off the tee so I gather they must know these houses there where I think uh, I would look at putting netting up myself, you know, for them people that do want to slice. Uh, which, which we all do, I suppose, now it's often. Right, so we're now on the fourth. Um, it is raining, so I'm trying not to use the camera as much as I can. This will give you a, a view of the course. So I'll we'll just turn it round. This is the fourth hole. As you can see, we're backing onto some houses. So if you uh, you lived close by, you'd uh, have some nice uh, view of a golf course. And there's planes coming over every, every five seconds. I mean, I'm used to them, but some people wouldn't be if you don't play that often. Um, but yeah, it is a bit noisy. Right, so we try the fourth hole, which is... 421 yards, so we'll see what we can do on here. There's trees to the right, so you're looking if you slice again, you go in uh, out of bounds. I'm looking down the bottom of the tee, I don't know whether you can see it. Let me put you down. The flag is right down in the corner. Ooh. 
you might just be able to see the top of it. Okay, so we're going to go to the fourth hole and I'll pick you up on the fifth. Don't go away. Oh, but I forget, if I forget, if you want to subscribe to the channel, click on the button somewhere around here. And also give us a thumbs up and a like. Uh, we're now up to 22, it'd be nice to get up to a few more before uh, the end of the month, if possible. Hi right, guys, let's talk to you shortly. Guys, oh, we've got a break from the uh, the rain, so I'll just bring you out a bit. So we're on the fourth tee, turn you back down there. That's where we've come from. As you can see again, there's plenty of houses on your right hand side. So yeah, so if you're gonna slice the ball, you're gonna hit some houses, I think. So, uh, yeah. I'm sure that's probably why there's a lot of insurance paid out. So, yeah, so sunshine and rain, sunshine and rain, British weather. So, we're just going to come up to the fourth hole, which is seven iron. I think he's just short of the green. And I've lost two balls already. Plenty more in the bag. So yeah, so far, nice little course. Could do with some uh, directions really between the uh, first and second, because you haven't got a clue which uh, hole you're going to. I had to ask somebody, which was uh, quite embarrassing really. Uh, never mind. But they've got a sign there going from the uh, third to the fourth. So we're just coming to the yeah, we'll just short the, the green. Not a bad shot that, for seven iron. Right guys, hole number five. Short one. 97 yards. There's your flag. Yeah, it's 97 yards. And uh it's got one, two, three, four bunkers all around it I can see. Uh, so yeah, it's just like a bit of a pitch and putt on this one. So we'll see how close we can't get it, or how far away we do get it. So, don't go away, back shortly. Guys, on the uh, on the six, just quickly show you these bunkers around the one before the fifth. As you can see, there's one, two, three, four, five bunkers there, which is uh, quite daunting, really. When you uh, you think of what you got to try and do. Right, so we're going to tee off on the six. Can't really club in the way, and uh, we'll sort you after the six. Let's see how we got on. I have a feeling though, when we're playing, we're going to go right, but no matter. So yeah, so that goes all the way around the course, and it doesn't smell nice. So, we're on to the 8th hole now. Alright guys, so we're up the 8th tee, 8th fairway, and I do find it bizarre, whether it's just me, comment below, that there's sort of like a driving range in the middle of the fairway. So you could be walking up the fairway and there's people practicing driving. Which I do find strange but what do I know? I've never seen anything like that before in my life. 
Um, so yeah, so I don't know about that. Hey guys, back again. Let's go to the ninth tee, final hole. We're only doing nine. This is a nine hole course, but they do have uh, three guys who can go around twice. Uh, which is good. Uh, so we're at now on number nine, and it's one, four, five, par three. Let's see if I can show you it. That's the uh, gents, the little whites. Whites a bit about there. And the ladies, one, three, seven. And let's see if I can show you the hole. As you can see, oh, it's a bad fly. There is bunkers all around the flag. So if you like bunkers, with a bucket and spade, this is the ideal course for you. So uh, right, let's have a go. See if we can uh, get on the green at least without hitting a bunker. So last hole. I'll speak to you when we're finished. Don't go away. Hi guys. We're all done here. Cheeto. Lanes are going over. So definitely, uh, these are course you got to play a couple of times to get used to it. Um, obviously, as I said before, the first tee and the third tee, uh, you're a bit conscious that in case you slice the ball, that you're going to hit the clubhouse or the houses. So it's a bit off-putting on your game, but. I suppose uh, you should have the confidence to do it. So yeah, nice. Uh, it's worth the play. Uh, I'll put a full description of the club in the uh, description. Um, you can join. It's not one of the cheapest clubs in the area, but it is the second oldest in the northwest. So we'll put a description of uh, membership and stuff below on the website where you can check them out. Right, guys. Thanks for watching. Uh, next, what we're going up next? We've got the Golf Vlogs UK Charity Do next Sunday. Hopefully, we're playing with Big Oggy. We've asked to play with him, we'll see what happens. And uh, we had to meet a few of the other YouTubers who are out there, hopefully, catch up with a few people ready for when we go to Portugal next uh, November. I'm sorry, next January and February, about the time. So, yeah, thanks for watching. I hope the uh, video has been useful for you. And it's not just a normal course, it's just it's a way you might want to come and play with your mates, something different. Thanks for watching, see you soon.